Here we are, waiting for the movie. Ooh, it's probably gonna start in like six minutes. That was fucking awesome! So I assume you've all seen the footage that happened before the, well, before the, this section of the video started. Yeah. I'm impressed. This is like one of the best movies I've ever seen. So I'm gonna go into not really much detail since this is gonna be a spoiler free review. But 10 out of 10, I loved it. It was definitely by far the best MonsterVerse movie I've seen in a while. I will be a, what's the word? Seeing it again, I just loved it that much. Yeah, so this is just a quick video. I know I made a video earlier since, well, it was a quick video before I went to see the movie. And oh boy, what a great film. I just, I look different. Like, after, after the first time I recorded, I look somewhat different. Hmm. Yeah, I just ignore this random banter about, not banter, random talk. Yeah, so, really good movie. Really good movie. I'm gonna give it maybe a month or a month and a bit until I actually go into the spoiler review which will and hopefully by then people would be well they'd catch they'd know what to expect in the film I've said to many people I'm not gonna spoil this film since I know that a lot of people are really excited to see it and I don't want to like go oh uh, this happened in the film, or that happened in the film. It's just gonna ruin a lot of people's days, and that's against my code of honor, in a way. I'm not going to ruin anyone's experience for the film. But like I said, really good movie. Definitely going to be in my top 10, actually. Maybe top 5 favorite Godzilla movies. But definitely in the top 10 for my favorite giant monster movies of course ah but i did actually but after the film i'm actually happy that i got to talk to someone who is a hardcore godzilla fan yeah we were talking i was talking with this guy i'm not we'll get you know we'll give him his give him a name we'll call him andrew since i don't want to reveal his uh full name his actual name because he might get offended by that, or wouldn't want me to do it. But we talked about, oh, imagine if, how the mon if the monster first continues, what monsters should be added into the into the film, such as, you no. Know, uh, there was a possibility of Destroyer being entered, well, being in the monster verse. We also talked about the old films, the new books that are coming out. And that made my night, after the film, that made my night. Ah, it's so good talking with a, uh, another hardcore Godzilla fan that isn't someone I know online. So, Andrew, if you're watching this, thank you. It was fun talking with you, my guy. Anyways, I'm possibly going to end this video here. I just wanted to, um... Well, I just wanted to say that I loved it. It's a good movie. I'm probably not going to continue on because I feel like if I do talk about the movie a little bit longer, going to an actual review, I might spoil something. So, I didn't really, I didn't, like, from what I saw, I couldn't even find, find an issue with the film, which is... <laughs> surprising but no, I mean I'm kind of a child so I'm not I'm probably not going to look at the what's it called the problems probably maybe when it comes out on DVD who knows uh 
yeah. So, definitely a really good monster movie. It blew my expectations, and if that's, it's definitely subverted them. And this might, well, be me saying that it subverted my expectations will probably hype up a lot more, a lot of other people. Yeah. If you are a person that doesn't care about the movie, just, but also went to see it and record scenes just to make people angry, what the hell is wrong with you? I've already seen, before the, I went to see the film today, that there are people out there who are recording the fights and then uploading them onto YouTube, which is something that, uh, that disappoints me. Yeah. Anyways, this is Mr. DGK, and I'll catch you all on the next video.